Can well, we the, Hunter, the Hunter Biden thing is the gr- greatest example yes! of that. There's almost no pushback on the left. There's no outrage, no chaos. Uh, here, oh, you know, here's the most disgusting part of that: that he and the and the and and the president wouldn't recognize his daughter. Okay, that is disgusting, especially if you believe that you know, like. There's all this evidence, you know, getting raised by a single mother is is not, a, you know, it's not a good thing for your outcomes in life. Yes, plenty of people overcome it. Yes, we don't want to stigmatize. But in general, it's better to have two parents involved. OK, mm-hmm. you have the son of the president of the United States refusing to acknowledge his daughter. OK, that is disgusting. And it shouldn't. And, the, and, and if is you're that all, because he didn't think it was his? It was a, here's a thing? DNA proof. After. He's paying child support. He so just, even after the DNA? Yeah, proof. he still refuses. And the Biden said, we have six grandchildren. They have seven mm. grandchildren. Mm. Okay. That is a national shame. And, the, and I don't care if you're on the left or the right. It is not right. The thing about him is just that he's such a hot wire. <laughs> it's like you can't touch it. It's just he's too much there. You don't want to bring any attention. If you were on the left, you wouldn't want to bring any attention to him. And that laptop and those business dealings and all that stuff. Because, like, if that was the Trump family, oh, my God. It'd be like, we told you. We <laughs> told you. But but, the, yeah, but you think the Trumps are much better? Like, they're – look how much money – look how much money Jared Kushner made when he was in the White House. Look, at, look I mean, it's crazy how much money the Trumps are making and did make. It's uh, – yeah, no one's saying that that's good either. Right. That's the thing about someone. No one doing has any some, shame. Yeah. People love people on the left love to do that though. As soon as you point out anything on the left, they go, "What about Trump? <laughs> what about Trump?" Is like they should make a T-shirt that just says, "What about Trump?" Because that's like one of those things that they say. And yeah, you're right though. You're right. That kind of corruption's uh, that's inexcusable too. And you know, some of it is just business. Air quotes. Right. Right. With the yeah. Saudis. Right. I'd love to hear about that business. It's fascinating. The guy's got, <laughs> you know, Kushner's, Kushner's 35. He's got his whole life to suck at the trough. Like, did he have to do it when his father-in-law was in the White House? I don't know the, the details behind that. What happened? I mean, so he made, he and Ivana made an enormous amount of money, uh, like, during the four years of the Trump administration. Mm. And, uh, you know, you can look it up. I don't want to quote a figure because I don't want to be wrong. But it, but, but it, it, is, it is an absolutely stunning amount of money. And so, and, you know, and now Kushner, you know, he's got, he's got Saudi money that he's managing. It's, I just, I, I don't know. I don't know where we are as a country. It seems, it seems like the people in charge think that anything goes. Mm. What do you think of RFK Jr.? I like him personally. I've been, I've been interviewed by him. I think, I think he's, I think he's right to raise questions about the mRNAs. I don't agree with a lot of the details of what he says. He's a fascinating guy. You've interviewed him, right? Yeah, I really enjoyed talking to him. I didn't, what's really important is his work as an environmental attorney and mm-hmm. what he did with the Hudson River. They cleaned up the Hudson River. So a lot of it based on. Him winning cases. Yep. And he really cares about people. He re- genuinely does. I think he's a good person. I really do. Would you vote for him? Yeah, I'd vote for him. Huh? Yeah, I would. I don't think I'm going to get the opportunity. <laughs> <laughs> doesn't, doesn't look that I way. I have a feeling. They have a feeling. They've got some rascally tricks up their sleeves to keep him from ever challenging. And there's, there's not going to be any debates, that's for sure. Yes. You know, which is, uh, it's just, I just... I really want to know. I mean, this is like a show that I can't stop watching. If I, if I, if I wasn't personally involved, it wasn't a, you know something going on in the country that I turn uh, that I live in. I would be like, wow, a show. This is crazy. <laughs> is that guy gonna make it? Like, what's gonna happen? Is she gonna be the president? Like, are we, is Russia gonna nuke us? I would be like, what a show. <laughs> this show's crazy. You know, you could, opium is legal. You could sell pills, yeah. but marijuana is not. Okay, mushrooms aren't, but you know, fentanyl is. Like, okay, this show's crazy. Look, they got alcohol. They drive fast. <laughs> they, they're putting speed cameras up all around LA now. They got a. They they give putting speed cameras up where they give you a certain ticket for X amount of miles you go over the speed limit. Is that true? Yeah. See if you can find that. I just saw this. It's so like okay. 
So Big Brother's watching you to drive, watching you drive down the street now. So you're still leaning towards not interviewing Trump. Is that right? I don't want to interview anybody. Oh, how about that? Speed camera bill in California heads to Newsom for approval. Please, Gavin, don't do this. Oh, you know he's going to do it. Please don't. 11 do this, miles Gavin. over? Yeah, issue automatic tickets for driving drivers going at least 11 miles over the speed limit. Cameras would be prioritized in areas surrounding schools, high injury intersections, and known street racing corridors to reduce speeding and traffic fatalities. Oh, well, hold on a second. You put it that way. I'm like, okay. Yeah. Are there certain areas? But the problem is, once you allow it in that area, like, oh, we're going to put it Prioritize means nothing. Yeah, prioritize is a weird word. Yes. Um, But... If that's the case, because like those fucking street takeovers, like that's bananas. Like <laughs> these fuck. And that's- how many times do you have to see on Instagram some dude standing around the circle <laughs> and the guy spinning around his car and hits one with the ass <laughs> end and sends him flying through the air? <laughs> Jesus Christ, kids, get the fuck out of that circle. I know it's a thrill, but get out of there, that's man. That's pure Darwin. That's get out of there, man. <laughs> You know, it's like those, like, you'll see it even in the Tour de France. Those people are on the side. Well, yes, occasionally, they take out one of those bikers. All the time. It happens all <laughs> yes, the time. Yes. And he, then there's like 83 of them go down. Right. I mean, trusting just regular people to stand there. Like, you, one's going to be a moron. Yes. One's going to be on their phone. One's yes. going to have a text that they yes. can't not answer. Waving a French flag. Or whatever. Yeah. They're going to do something. They're going to they try. They've got toxoplasmosis. Well, also, the fucking, when you have, like, car races, when, like, they're doing those rally races, yes. like, those people are out of their mind. Those yes. things come sideways around corners. There's people right there. <laughs> but at least those are experts. Those street racing kids are just nuts. <laughs> Like, how did that happen? That's tree takeover you, thing. You, when did that first start? You, you are place? jealous of this, I can Street tell. Street takeover? Yeah, yeah. No. You wish you were all. in one of those cars. What? How dare you? <laughs> I'm not interested in that at all. I, I don't want to spin around in a circle. I have zero <laughs> desire to spin around in a circle. But, I mean, I wonder if that was like, was Fast and the Furious yes. about that no, or was no, it no, before no. that? Before, before. So the street takeovers were before? Yeah, way before. 80s Oakland. Side shows. Side shows. Oh, 80s in that. Oakland. Wow. Informal social gatherings of Bay Area youth. Sideshows. That's what they would call them. Mm-hmm. So they would just take over an intersection and start spinning around in circles. Mm-hmm. <laughs> how, how long did that generally last? How long? Uh, half until hour, somebody died. Half minutes, hour. 15 minutes. Guys have like held up an intersection for half hour just oh. spinning around in circles. I, I would imagine. Have you been to the long. Bay Area recently? What it's kind of wi- anything goes. What a wild thing to do, though, to make everybody <laughs> stop so you drive in a circle in your car. <laughs> And everybody does. They know what's going on, so they all just deal with it. What are you going to do? That's nuts. Here's a 